What's up guys, my name is Rednaz and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Now before the video starts, I just want to let you guys know that I am on the road to 500 subscribers. If you guys would like to help me reach that goal, I would really appreciate it if you go down below and hit the subscribe button. You can also tick the notification bell next to it so that you always get notified whenever I upload a video. But with that being said, thanks for watching the video and I hope you enjoy. Now today, the video that I have for you, as you can see, we are on the Bedrock Edition of Minecraft. I just wanted to put this out there for everybody that plays on Bedrock Edition that doesn't think that they get enough love. So here we are today on the Bedrock Edition. Now I'm assuming if you guys clicked on this video, you guys need help with the map room achievement and I'm here to give you guys that help. So first things first, get your nine maps. Step number two, find your middle starting point. So for example, Oh, look at this, a conveniently placed map wall that I absolutely didn't put here 30 seconds ago. I guess we can use this for the guide. So what you're going to want to do with the first map, you want to create your middle starting point. So as you guys can see, this is my middle map. We are right about here. So after this, what you're going to want to do, you can place your middle map if you'd like, but the way that I do it personally, but me personally, I like to keep map number one with me. And once you get off the edge of the map, you're going to want to create another map. Now, as you can see, this is the map that's directly under my middle map. So we'll go ahead and toss that into the grid here. And I want to put a little disclaimer here. When you guys are playing in survival, these maps do not come filled all the way out for you. You actually have to go around and fill these out yourself. So the way that I personally like to do it and the way that I think is the easiest, I like to wait to do this achievement until I have an elytra because that way I can just fly around and fill in the map relatively easily. But if you do not have an elytra, you are going to have to run, which will take you longer. I'm sorry, but that's the bottom line. If you don't have an elytra, it's going to take you quite a while to fill out these maps. So I'm just going to go ahead and fill in the rest of these maps like so, making sure that I've got all of them filled up. Skip the middle one there, skip this one as well. And there you have it, you got yourself an easy achievement. If this video helped you out in any way, please make sure to hit the like button down below. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to put them in the comments down below. I always respond to my comments. If you guys know me from my other tutorial videos, then you guys know that I'm always responding to comments over there. And I think it's been nearly a year since that video came out and I'm still responding to comments. So, so if you guys have any questions, make sure to put them down in the comments below and I'll try my best to answer them. If you guys are enjoying these Minecraft videos and you wanna see more, like I said at the beginning of the video, we are on the road to 500 subscribers and if you guys want to contribute to that goal please feel free to click the subscribe button down below tick the notification bell next to it so you guys get notified whenever i upload a new video and as always my name is rednaz and i'll see you guys in the next video see you later